problem I already addressed. Back swing, getting the club at the top, right? But look at this, this is a problem. It's an easy one to fix, but it's a problem. It's the reason that you're having so much inconsistency. All right, so everything's pretty good to here. A little bit of sway in the right hip, but not bad. All right, so Molinari is going to make a little bit of a lateral move to initiate the downswing. There's a lateral and rotational component to the downswing. That's there's impact. Yeah. His left arm is nice and straight, connected right here. All right, you got a little bit of an impact issue. What's wrong with that? Left arm's not straight. Yeah, that's going to kill your game. The radius of the swing is the length of the left arm from the left humerus plus the length of the club. If you change that, you're done. You got no consistency. Now, it's easy to fix. You're going to have to do a lot of punch shots. Working on extension, getting long through the ball. Your right arm's going to straighten. Your left arm's going to squeeze out and extend. You got to do that at the ball. You got to get full extension at the ball. Your head drops back and down too much here. That's actually not a bad. I thought it was worse. Never mind. That's not so bad. So that's killing your game right there. Watch this guy here. This guy's one of the best in the world, ball strikers. See the left elbow and the left arm, how it's against the chest? You got the fr uh, fantasy fantasy thing? He's good to have. He's a great ball striker. I've played with him. Too. Huh? I got Stenson too. Oh, yeah, you're in good shape. What did he shoot today? I don't know. So that's what you got to work on. You got to get this impact drill. I'm going to show you. Put a stick six inches behind your ball, like an alignment rod. You're going to hit balls. You're going to try to get the handle forward of the ball. The grip of the club in front of the ball at impact. Your cl your club is not there. See, the grip of the club is is not in front of the ball. Here, the shaft should point. Yeah, shaft should point to your left hip or light, slightly in front of it. See how his hands are in front of the club head there? Yep. So that's your problem. That's your whole. That's a big problem. Watch this. Watch this take away. This is dumb. He works with Chuck Cook. Chuck's a good friend of mine. And I see that takeaway. There's no hand action. Look at that club face. It's still pointing at the ground. There's no rotation. But watch the impact position. All great players, the shaft runs through the left forearm, period. The left arm and shaft form a straight line condition and impact. You got to have that to play well. You can't be where you're at and play well. So you got to hit a lot of punch shots or just do a, call, a couple drag drills. You take a club and drag it along the ground. From Put the club head one foot behind your right foot and drag it all the way forward. Hold it on the ground. Put it on the ground. No, put it on the ground. Drag it forward. Keep it on the ground. A little bigger. No, you're keeping it. You're not keeping it on the ground. See this drill I'm doing right here? Take it back with one hand. Drag the handle forward. See that stick? 
put an alignment rod right six inches behind the ball. If you scoop it and you bend your left wrist, you'll hit the stick every time. There's impact. Shaft points to left tip. Right wrist is bent. Left wrist is flat. Look at his right wrist. Look at uh, look at my right wrist and look at Duffner's right wrist. It's like that. It's not like this. It's like that. There's an angle here. The palm is perpendicular to the target line. You're looking at your left hand. I'm looking at my right hand. When you try real hard on there. So that's yeah, of course. Watch his right arm. Look at the right wrist. Okay, where's the right wrist? It's like that, isn't it? Watch this. Where's the right wrist? Where's the handle? Front of the club head. Watch this. Who's this guy? Where's the shaft? Pointed at the left tip. In line with the left forearm. Handles always in front of the club head with all great players. Like right here, the club sits pretty much in the middle of the bottom of the club. I don't want to lean it. Hunter Mayhem. This edge. I don't want to lean it on this edge. I want it to sit. Same thing. When it sits in the middle, and you'll never see it. You'll never see it. Right arm is really It is. It is. You'll never see a great player though that doesn't have a good impact position. You're never going to see your impact position. Corey Pavin. Left wrist is bent, arched, because he has a weak grip. He has a grip like yours. Your left hand was way too weak. So when you swing, you're like that. Charlie Swartzel, great golf swing right here. Bent right wrist, flat left wrist, shaft points at the left tip. Shaft is in line with the lead forearm. Doesn't matter who I put up here, they all look the same. Left arm's connected to the chest, 